This lecture was part of Rob Jor's exclusive learning program. To join, email info at imuna.com or call, text, or WhatsApp 1-347-972-9400. In every moment of our lives, we have an intersection of two options. We can go to the right and choose right, and we can go to the left and to make a mistake with our free choice. The real guiding line, the real um, light that should shine our path and our road must always be the truth. The truth should be the candle um, in your path. And a person can find that way of understanding what will be the right choice, what will be the right decision by attaching himself to his heart, to his honesty. And when you don't know if to go to the right and you don't know if to go to the left because you don't know what the future is preparing to you in the next part of, of the road, you can always count on your heart, on your honesty that will lead you to the right direction by choosing to be truthful, by choosing to use your good attributes, your manners, to be nice, to be polite, to be sensitive. Those are the main commandments that the way of the land, that honesty, that good attributes will be our foundations for our walk in the journeys of life. The person can never know what the future will bring. And it's very important to count on ourselves and to know that we are here to reflect the light of our soul. And the light of our soul is the light of goodness that shines from within. The light of our soul is the light of the godliness that is treasured within us. And therefore, when we are connecting ourselves to the good, to the goodness of our soul, to the bright and beautiful side of our personality, of our being, of our spirit, and we overpower the darkness of our physicality, of our laziness, of our heaviness, of our sadness and bad attributes, when we do so by working to reveal the goodness of our spirits, by that we are crowning Hashem, the Creator in the world, and we are establishing the kingship of heavens on the kingship of earth. And we're creating similarity between the heavenly kingship of Hashem to the structure that is ready and prepared for the great royalty of Hashem um, to take place by perfecting our form to the form that ideally the Creator created us um, in, that is the Tselem Elohim, the shape of God. The body is of course not the shape of God because God does not have a shape and does not have a body. Therefore, we need to make ourselves similar to Him in spirit because He is spirit and we are half spirit, portion of godly spirit lives within us. And that is the godly portion that we've been blessed with. And therefore, by making ourselves controlled by, by our good inclination, we are revealing that holy and highly portion of our being to overpower and conquer the way for the light of the godly kingship to shine, heal, bless the world from our central point to our surroundings and our surroundings to their greater circles and the light to spread in the whole wild world. May it happen in our days. Amen. DMC with the Muna project, all the nations with me. Close your eyes, just breathe, see the truth. Don't chase the fake world, don't buy the fake news. Be yourself, your own true self. Don't let no one take our natural wealth. See the good, no fear, no despair. Cherish who that you are and share. Source of power from an endless spring. Light up the courage in yourself. They can kick you down to the Hold yourself up till you are put up your crown King of the creator, holy soul inside Focus on the spiritual and you shall